Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and this is my 600th Energy Drink Review video. It's 4.33 p.m. on Sunday, February 7th, 2016. I forgot to mention in my last review and show you that I'm on the Rockstar Punched Blue Raspberry Energy Drink. There's, like, text in the background. I don't know if you could really see it good. See, like, right there, there's, like, text... Um, yeah, there's like text in the background, but it's sort of hard to see, so I just wanted to show off that. But anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing something really rare and discontinued. It came out in 2007, it was discontinued in 2010, so yeah. So yeah, so today I'm going to be reviewing a Java Monster, and it's cool. And I finally have this. It's, like, dented a lot, but I got it for pretty cheap, considering what their good condition price one goes on eBay for. I got this one for a pretty good deal. So anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the Low Ball Java Monster. Aw, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I got this from my friend Gordon's friend, like, L. Um, or Eli. So, yeah, I got this for only $20 with free shipping. There's one currently on eBay for $45 and about $16 shipping. So, a little bit over $60. So, yeah, I got this, like, way cheaper. Even though it's dented and stuff, I don't really care. I just wanted it to, like, review it and stuff because it's full, and you know. So, yeah. And L, like, found this at a CVS. So he was pretty lucky to find this, because this one's, like, really rare. Anyway, it has a gold top with a black monster tab. Lowball Java Monster, coffee plus energy. 15 fluid ounces, 443 milliliters. Energy supplement. Um, this is, like, the early version of the vanilla light Java Monster. It's basically the same thing. So, you know, so if you want to try this, you can just try the vanilla light Java Monster. Because they basically only changed the name, because like the description and stuff this is like the same. Has SKU and some codes. Java Monster, how low can you go? Ounce for ounce, Java Monster already has way less fat and calories than Mega Bucks. Um, bottled coffee, so why make low ball? Because our fearless leader is a health fanatic who counts calories like their hundred dollar bills. Art versus science, seriously making a low calorie coffee energy drink that tastes good and works ain't that easy. Java Monster Low Ball sets a new standard for taste and effectiveness. While no Mona Lisa, Low Ball is a truly a work of art with a little science thrown in for good measure. www.monsterenergy.com. So that's basically like the same saying as Vanilla Light. Supplement facts: serving size eight fluid ounces, 240 milliliters. Servings per container about two. Calories 50. Calories from fat 15. Total fat 1.5 grams, 2%. Saturated fat 1 grams, 5%. Trans fat 0 grams, 0%. Cholesterol 5 milligrams, 2%. Total carbs 6 grams, 2%. Sugars 4 grams. Protein 3 grams. Calcium 90 milligrams, 10%. Vitamin C 30 milligrams, 50%. Vitamin D 16 IU 5%. Potassium 60 milligrams, 2%. Vitamin B2, 1.7 mg, 100%. Vitamin B3, 20 mg, 100%. Vitamin B6, 2 mg, 100%. Vitamin B12, 6 micrograms, 100%. Phosphorus, 60 mg, 5%. Sodium, 230 mg, 8%. Taurine, 1,000 mg. Panax Ginseng, 200 mg. Energy Blend, it's 2,500 mg. L-carnitine, glucose, caffeine, guarana. Most tall, glucuronolactone, maltodextrin. Has the other ingredients... Copyright 2007 Monster Beverage Company. Canned under the authority of the Monster Beverage Company. 550 Monica Circle, Corona, California. 92889 USA. Consume responsibly. Limit three cans per day. Not recommended for children, pregnant women, or people sensitive to caffeine. Has the ball logo. These statements have not been evaluated by the FDA. It's not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, prevent any disease. So yeah. And... Also, just add as an added note, on the old cans it said Monster Beverage Company. Keep that in mind. 
Because, like, they recently changed it, like, to Monster Energy Company, but it was originally Monster Beverage Company, not Energy. So keep that in mind, because I got some insider information that later this year, Monster is going to be releasing some products that aren't Energy. So just keep that in mind. So that's like an added insights, I guess, for the future. Because, you know, it was beverage company, so they can do anything. They don't have to just release energy products. So just keep that in mind. Like, that's a hint. Really big hint, actually. Because I know they're going to be releasing some cool stuff. It has, like, a white background with, like, yellow stuff all around it. But now light has, like, a better pattern, I think. This one's more simplistic. Has the triangles and stuff at the top like Locomoca and Mean Bean has. So I'll let you see it. Okay. See it's like dented and stuff. Has a gold M. See it has like the yellow and dotted like dotted pattern and stuff. See it's like dented. the paint's like messed up up there um, but I think you can see this pretty easily except this one has a lot of stuff on it because I don't think the vanilla light had this much ingredients in it Okay, in a way it has a pretty cool can design, I'm going to shake it up, I'm going to open it and pour it in my glass and taste it and give my review for it, so hold on a minute, but also, like Gordon packages his like drinks well, it's in like a cardboard tube with like bubble wrap and it's plastic, so he does a good job of packaging his stuff, even though I got it from L or Eli, um, I think it goes by both names, but on Facebook it's just L. But I think it's actually Eli. But, um, anyway, like, Gordon was the one who shipped it. So he didn't have to, like, pay because he, like, lives near Gordon. So Gordon was the one who packaged it. So he packaged it pretty well. So, yeah, so hold on a minute. Okay, I opened it, and I guess it still had some of the carbonation left because it exploded a little bit when I opened it. There's, like, some bubbles at the top. It's, like, creamy and brown. Looks like chocolate milk or something. But it's like coffee. Yeah, it smells a lot like the Vanilla Light Java Monster, so maybe a little bit darker. Yeah. And I'm surprised this one doesn't actually have a lot of chunks in it. Still looks sort of fresh with all that, like, froth and stuff. So, yeah, there's, like, not any chunks or anything. Like the Russian had. And, like, Big Black. So, that's cool. Anyway, it smells pretty good, actually. <sighs> smells a lot like Vanilla Light, except a little bit darker. 
maybe a little bit more like if you mixed Vanilla Light and Loca Mocha. Yeah, it smells pretty good, and I'm going to try it. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Really good coffee flavor. Yeah, it does definitely taste like Vanilla Light, except a little bit darker. I don't know if it tastes a little bit bitter because it's like old, but I think that might actually be how it's supposed to taste. Because it still is like really frothy and stuff. Because like um, the Russian and stuff like wasn't that frothy. So this one's still actually a little bit fresh, I guess. Um, maybe the Russian and stuff wasn't kept in a refrigerator for like a certain amount of time, and maybe this low ball was. So that means that's probably, probably a little bit fresher. Yeah, it's pretty good. I'm not gonna try it out of the can. Okay. I think it tastes better in the glass. And yeah, and like when I poured it out, it's like feels like it's like more fragile now because of all the dents and stuff. So that sucks. Yeah, it still tastes fresh. It's pretty good. I highly recommend you trying this if you can find it. There's one on eBay, but it's like pretty expensive. But I got a good deal on this one. I only paid 20 for it, even though it's like pretty dented. I don't really care because I just wanted to like review it and for my collection. Um, and energy wise, it lasts about four and a half hours to about five and a half hours, so it works pretty good. Tastes good. I like it. I still wish they would have kept it low ball instead of like changing it to vanilla light, but whatever. I like it. So I give the low ball Java Monster a 10 out of 10. Highly recommend you trying it if you can somehow get it. If you're lucky, you can find it or you can get it off of eBay, but it's probably going to be expensive. But yeah, so I want to say thank you for all my subscribers, and I'll keep doing reviews. Stay tuned for more reviews. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye. Oh, and I love my fans, so thanks. Bye.